And the talking has to stop and the action finally begins. A warm welcome to Wembley from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson and we're just seconds away from kickoff time in what promises to be a wonderful Carabao Cup final. It is Liverpool taking on Chelsea. What a chance for one of these teams to get their hands on silverware. And over the years, we've seen some great League Cup finals. Let's hope today matches up to some of those occasions. Really looking forward to this one, Derek. Number six, Thiago. Number 20, Diogo Jota. Number 11, Mo Salah. And so the battle commences. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Now he must favour the cross. Robertson. Now moving the ball impressively here. And a look at the Chelsea starting 11. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. As Pini Quetta plays with Marcos Alonso in the fullback positions. Jorginho plays with Ngoro Conte in the centre of the park. And handed the task of playing up front today, Romelu Lukaku. Marcos Alonso. What a shocking pass, really. Ngolo Conte. This is Thiago Silva. Well, nicely cut out. Mane. Fabinho. Well read to put an end to that attack. Aspili Quetta. Ngoro Conte Romelu Lukaku now Jorginho in behind for him to chase oh body in the way crucially Mane Diogo Jota it's a weighted pass And this is Diogo Jota now. And the possession lost, intercepted. This is Thiago. Putting his body on the line. And plenty of space for this Chelsea attack. Read it superbly to take back possession. Splendid tackle and a throw in coming up. Well, there you have it. In terms of possession, there's not much in it. It really has been a hard fought battle so far. One of these teams needs to start taking a risk or two. Not messing around with that clearance. Really getting stuck in. Well, possibilities in the centre. Unable to keep the ball. Fabinho. Well, not the pass he had in mind. Marcos Alonso. Pulisic now. Jorginho and space for them here on the flank oh good looking run a chance then for the respective managers to address their charges it is half time here
And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Nice ball to switch the point of attack. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Thiago Silva. Rudiger has it. Lukaku. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Just made sure nothing came of that. Tiago. Here is Tiago. On a pass that lacks quality. Conte. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Read it well. to read it and get there and did Fabinho Salah and this is Diogo Jota now it's with Fabinho Liverpool in a position of menace Andrew Robertson Jota opportunity here Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Goalkeeper getting in the way. Superb save. Substitution for Liverpool. Coming so making the, the substitution now. Diogo Jota. Coming onto the pitch. Number nine, Roberto Firmino. So the corner played into the box. Well, sadly, too straight to worry the goalkeeper that time. Well, those stats aren't great reading, are they? Neither side is playing with any fluency so far, and as a result, we've seen a pretty dull game. It has to get better. There's a thorough understanding of defending Aspini Quetta. Thiago Silva Conte now Jorginho Rudiger Pulisic now Conte showing excellent vision wonderfully weighted pass well a top-notch piece of defensive judgment Five minutes remaining then, and the score sheet remains blank. Pulisic. High quality defending. Well, you can hear the Liverpool fans driving their team forward. Are we going to have a dramatic finish here? And intercepts again. 
Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Lukaku. And Chelsea still knocking on the door in the closing minutes. Can they find a winner? A final that will live long in the memory. It's not finished yet because it's going to come down to a penalty shootout to settle the outcome. And this will test the mentality of any footballer. Oh, brilliant goalkeeping. Can he convert? And off the top of the crossbar. Well, not an effort for his own personal scrapbook. Too much elevation. Off the crossbar. Well, it's a long way off target. That wasn't easy to do. Superb execution. Not what he was looking for. Off the crossbar. Well, the keeper wasn't worried in the slightest. And off the top of the crossbar. And he steps up to take his penalty. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. It all falls on his shoulders. If he scores, they win. Such high levels of pressure. He must score to keep his side in it. Goalkeeper beaten from the spot. And now a heaven-sent opportunity to win the match. Oh, that's it! The final act in the drama. One team jubilant, the other distraught. Well, what an end into a very good tournament, and I think they fully deserve to win it. Maybe not in this manner, though, but it was great entertainment. It certainly was, and they're not going to forget this in a hurry. A proud moment for everyone involved with the club.